This video covers how to set up your Word document in APA format. This video has been updated to reflect changes made to the 7th edition of the APA Style Guide. First, open Microsoft Word. Go to the Layout tab and double check that your margins are set to normal, one inch all around. Go back to the Home tab and choose the font and size. The new APA guidelines allow you to choose a font, but be sure to select a font type and size that is clear and legible. I'm going to use Times New Roman 12-point font. In the Line Spacing menu, change the line spacing to 2.0, double-spaced. Also choose Remove Space After Paragraph. We don't want any extra spacing after paragraphs or sections. Now it's time to set up your page numbers. Go to the Insert tab and select Page Number, Top of Page, Plain Number 3. Double-click in the area under the header to get back into the body of your paper. Page 1 will be your title page. Start by clicking Center Alignment. Press Enter a few times and type your paper title. For the title page, you should capitalize major words only, including nouns, verbs, adjectives, adverbs, and pronouns. Include the second part of hyphenated major words. Also, be sure to capitalize any word consisting of four more letters. After typing the title of your paper, hit Enter a few more times and type the following. Your name, academic department and college name, the course code and number, separated by a colon, the name of your professor, and lastly the due date of the assignment in the format of month, day, comma, year. Go back up to the title of your paper and set the font to bold type. Click on the Insert tab, select Page Break, and go down to Page 2. APA 7 style guidelines no longer require an abstract for student papers. Page 2 will be the beginning of your research paper body. In the center of the first line, Type the title of your paper again and click Enter once. Reset the alignment to left aligned. Go back up to the title of your paper and change the font to bold. Go back down to the second line and start typing your paper. Hit Tab once to indent the first line of every paragraph. The very last page of your paper is the References page. Go to the Insert tab and click Page Break to start a new page. Click Center and type References on the first line. Hit Enter once to go down to the next line and click Align Left. Go back up to the References line and bold the text. Come back down to Line 2 to start your References. References are in alphabetical order, double-spaced, with a hanging indent, and no space between paragraphs. To change those settings, click on the little arrow next to Paragraph, change the special menu to Hanging by 0.5 inches. Change the spacing before and after paragraphs to zero. Make sure the line spacing is set to double. Type or copy and paste your references. If you are copying and pasting your references from a library database or a citation generator, be sure to right-click the mouse and choose the Merge Formatting option so the pasted citation takes the same formatting you just set up. Always double-check your citations for accuracy after you paste them into your references list. If you have any questions about APA formatting, contact a librarian.